Hi everyone, it's happy mail time. So I got this box yesterday and Denise asked me to open it with her on Facebook. We had um, a chat and I opened it last night. But um, some of you wanted to see what was in that humongous box and she sent me, it's a birthday box. So she said that she had a few things that she wanted to share with me that she thought I could use for my mixed media or for the workshops. So she was going to send me some things, but I never, never imagined all of this stuff in this huge box. Thank you so much. So it's my belated birthday present and she found me micro beads. I've been searching for these forever. And the few times that I was able to um, get um, people to go to Michael's, I they couldn't find them. So finally I have that. I'm so happy. And then she also sent me some of the seed beads that um, came out from Michael's. So these are the colors that she found. She found the cream and the white. And she also found a pink and an aqua. So these are not things that she wasn't using. These she went and she searched for them for me. And I thank her so much. So much. Because I love those things for my projects. If you've seen my projects, you know I use them a lot. Then she also sent me this beautiful stamp. It's a roller stamp and it's cameras. Isn't that the cutest? I loved it, loved it. And then let's see. Okay, so these are a bunch of stamps that she shared with me. So she sent me this one with the keyhole and the key. And then that beautiful hello. And a cake. Oh my gosh. And I was opening this with her. So this is another one. With her on chat. We kept having issues with the connection yesterday. And then Beatrice kept coming in to find out what was in there. And I love that mason jar so much. I already have sort of like an idea with it. So that's why I placed it on that side. And then she sent me these. Yeah, so it was like excitement time last night with that huge box. Isn't that cute? Super pretty. I love them so much, Denise. And we had so much issues last night trying to open this with you. So now I get to share it again. And thank you properly. I love, love these goodies. And this, oh, I am in love with that aqua key. I love keys and I love collecting them. But she found those charms for me and I am so thankful. I love them. Love them, and that is my fave. I just love that one with the flower. Super, super pretty. Yeah, so I don't think these are the goodies that she said I could use for my mixed media projects that she wasn't using. I think these are things that she went and she got for me. So, wow. So she sent me those charms and then this spare part set of like different elements have to open that up later and take a look at them properly and then she sent me that beautiful um lock and look at these cute charms aren't those adorable super cute and that art cake i love with the word art on it super excited for that one total hoarding vault until i find something special to use it on and these are adorable look at this pretty vintage like um charms super pretty and then those are for my daughters so the mickey set and then i'm gonna give that to sophia my daughter because she loves stickers so i'm sending her that now i'm giving her that and then this is for them too so they'll be playing with those stamps they'll have fun and it's funny because my eldest daughter is like crazy with washi tapes and stickers i don't know why she loves them so much and look at the birdies those are so cute super pretty and then she sent me some michael's um little metal pieces now i don't have to hoard them that much and those um locks i didn't i had not seen before the ones with the hearts i had i don't remember seeing that and then she wasn't using this one so she sent it to me and i didn't have it so thank you and these pretty gel pens. 
And I don't know where that's from. I think it's, it looks like a target type of thing, but we don't have a target here, so I'm guessing. And look at these pretty gel pens, the tiny ones. Super cute. Love the colors. Those pastels are like so cute. Can't wait to try those and see how they work. And then this charm I found so exciting. I really loved it. And I think you can open it up. It has like seashells and um, a little starfish charm and some blingies. And this. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Can't wait to try those either. Look at the markers from Prima. So she knows that I like coloring and I use my stamps and... um. I think she wasn't using these, so she sent them to me. Wow, Denise. You're just amazing, girl. You totally, totally spoiled me. Yeah, so all of those sets she um, shared with me. And, wow. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm still in shock. And these are all goodies that I can use for my mixed medias or for the workshop. So that's a wonderful... I love that tag little book because I can totally take it apart and use it for my tag projects. And then she also shared these. And these are doilies from Recollections. I don't remember seeing those either. So she sent me two of those. And then this is a little chipboard album and I'm seeing something medieval with that instead of a crown so yeah or, or a castle I'm just I'm seeing something different so I already have like an idea of something that I can do with that and then she sent me this one she sent me two of those yeah two of those in that shape and then the scalloped square yeah so those are totally for the mixed media projects or for the kids and then she also sent those um two card sets from Paris themed super cute and these are <clears throat> sets of like pre-made cards that you can alter she, I told her that I love doing that and she shared a whole bunch a whole bunch I haven't opened those packages yet but and these I've been dying to see in person and to try Th those are embossed papers from David to Tara and I kept seeing them online and I was asking people if, if they knew what they were and no one seemed to know but Denise had some and she sent me those. So thank you. I can't wait to open those up and look at them carefully. And this is a little Christmas stamp set. Super cute. And it's from Recollections. And that I'll be able to use with my kids in the workshops. Or I'll even be able to take them to school during the holidays. So I can... Um, Give them a little stamp when they leave. And look at these. These are craft and they have all those edges. Love those too. I love working with craft and altering little cards. Those pre-made cards are so, so good to have. And these are other goodies. So she sent me those three ink pads. I have to try those. I've never seen these before. They have really pretty colors. So I have to try those out. And then she shared some of um these little blackboard altering pieces love those super cute so i have to see what i can use those for but they're super cute and then this door love 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 that door it's so big and thick and <gasps> yay wow. i have to see what i can do with that so can't wait um till i have time to come up with something to use that for because i really love that door and washies so she sent me this little bow washi super cute and the little owls also adorable and she shared some of the new washies with me she had some extras and she sent me those too and thank you because i didn't have any of the new um washies that came out so thank you so much she also sent me one of the little bottles that come with a pin so that you can keep it from drying up and I'll have to try that <clears throat> excuse me and then look at these these are adorable they're mason jars but they're ornaments I had not seen those before those should be fun to alter those would be fun projects to work on and then little wood veneers from Michaels 
I had not seen these either. These are like little doilies, but they have, it's like a tag. And I love that color, the darker one. Oh, I had not seen that color. Really like it. And these tags, and I love that they have like the little stitch edge look. Really like that. And she shared some pics. I've never altered one of those. So I have to see what I can use that for, but I'll, maybe for the workshops. I'll see. And then that frame. Thank you so much, Denise. I just, um, I keep, now that I'm looking at it again, it's like, ah, and look at that key. Beautiful key. And then these are wonderful to alter with like mixed media. And then she sent me a bird cage. This girl, I mean, I don't know. She like emptied her studio, her craft room into that box. Look at that humongous key that she sent. <laughs> Huge. And everything, everything was perfect. Nothing got damaged. So I was so glad. Look at those. So she shared some of the um, cards. And I think those are from Michael's. Super cute. Those made me laugh when I read them. And then I have a shabby chic set of pencils. Never had those before. Super pretty. And these I loved so much. Those are so pretty. The little macaroon erasers. And I think, I don't know, from the look of it, I think they're from Target, right? I don't know. And that I had to ask her. That's for stamping. It's like a little stamp block, but it ha comes with a handle, so... And I already used that today with the kids and the workshop and they worked really nicely. And then those little flowers I put on the side because those two I think I might use with the girls in the workshops this week. Super cute. And these, I love that denim line from, from Michael's. Those little pocket, jean pockets. Oh, super cute too. I don't make banners, but just to make them individually for something like special. And the little Michaels bags. And these I had not seen before either. They're like canvas but in red. So nice. Love those. And this one I fell in love with. It's a sticker set. But look at it. Tea time. And then it has a copy theme on it. But with glitter it's super pretty. And this one's super cute. The love stickers that they're dimensional with a bling and yay and butterflies i love butterflies so she also shared that stamp set i tell you this is like wow what an amazing birthday present i don't even mind that i had to wait that long for it <laughs> and then that little stamp she had not used so she sent it to me and another stamp Super cute for mixed media or for altering cards or anything like that. And a gorgeous girl. I love my gorgeous girl. They remind me of my girl Beatriz. Love her. So pretty. And Prima Borders. I did not have those. So cool. Those would be cool to play with. And then a humongous thank you. And when I opened that, I was like... That's perfect for you right now. It's like, thank you in like a humongous size. And then she also shared these, um, their Heidi Swap and their numbers and little embellished, little ephemera things that you can use. So those are cute. Those will be fun to um, use on ATCs or tags or anything mixed media. Fun. And then she sent me some black and white bling, clear bling. Always, always good to have. I always use those colors, so amazing. Thank you. And then she also included this super cute little bottles filled with like, they have like micro beads and glitter and little sequin pieces. It's like a nail art type of package, but it has like so many little things in there. And the size is tiny, so I love it. <laughs> I just looking at it, you know, it's fun. And this beautiful um, resin set i love that bird on it she also sent these two little booklets <sighs> super cute 
and a stencil by Heidi Swap. I love polka dots, so I was super happy to see that. And spatulas, those palette knives are always useful. So thank you so much for that too. I mean, she's like, and then this, I was searching for a big bag so I could put all of my gelatos in and I couldn't find one this past weekend. And when I saw that bag, I was like, oh, perfect. But then she had it filled with things that she was not using. So those are from that art, what is it, Art C? I had not, I mean, I've seen that brand on online hauls, but I, I had not seen it before the haul. So she sent me a whole bunch of things that she was not using. And I, she told me that that is like type of, it's like a acrylic paint, but with like a modeling paste type of um texture to it. I have to try them. And then there's glue and she sent me a bunch of distress stickles. So that's what's in there. I'm not going to take it all out, but it's just those tools and all those fun things to play with. So I'm super happy. I'll put those somewhere else and I'll use that back for the gelato. So thank you, Denise, because it's a perfect size for that. And then these are the last things. She sent all these beautiful little baggies with things in them and I opened them. So that's why they don't look as pretty anymore. And I'm going to open them up, but my video got cut something happened to the camera so i'm sharing these as i um place them in my hand but the rest i had to do it separately so oh my gosh i am like in shock with all of the goodies that she thought to send and then the things that she went to get for me look at these aren't these adorable i think i'm going to use some of those with the girls for the workshop also this week so Perfect timing for that too, but they're adorable and there's a whole bunch so I get to save them for other things And then she also sent those huge buttons that I can alter Super um, fun to use as bases So thank you so much for that too and um, Little resin flowers. I use them so much. So I'm so thankful. I love those and then she also sent some little metal pieces. So these are the little like label frames. And that one in the middle with the flowers is so pretty. I really like that. And some metal flowers with bling inside. She sent three of those and some of the bicycles and the birdies from the Michael sets. So yay that's what it was in my box i had to put it all back in last night and um i had to wait until today so i could share with all of you because i had a workshop this morning but that was an awesome birthday present even if it took like all of this time to get here i'm so happy so thanks everyone for coming bye bye and thanks